Is the innovation of inscription transactions beneficial for Bitcoin's network? Let's dive into the debate. According to Blastnode analyst James Check, inscriptions don't obstruct regular Bitcoin transactions. Instead, they just complement them, utilizing unused block space efficiently. In fact, inscriptions generate a significant portion of the network's total fees. This challenges the initial understanding of inscriptions as a protocol for adding NFTs to the waiting. Uh, initially associated with weighty image-based NFTs, inscriptions have evolved with the introduction of the BRC20 token standard. Uh, this second wave consists of smaller, yet more frequent text-based inscriptions, uh, expanding Bitcoin's UTXO set and boosting transaction fees. For instance, the creation of the BRC20 token um, SATS led to a substantial increase in Bitcoin UTXOs, demonstrating the impact of these inscriptions. Uh, despite the benefits highlighted by Czech critics, including Bitcoin Core developer Luke Dash Jair, denounce inscription transactions as spam, exploiting a flaw in Bitcoin's code. Dash Jair's mining pool, Ocean Filters Ops inscriptions to prioritize, quote, real transactions. And the debate between proponents and opponents of inscriptions underscores the ideological and practical divide within the Bitcoin community. In the end, the impact of inscription transactions on the Bitcoin network remains a topic of heated debate, with both sides presenting compelling arguments as the evolution of blockchain and technology continues. The implications of inscription transactions will likely remain a contentious issue within the crypto community. And remember, folks, whether you're in inscription or monetary testing, those Bitcoin transactions efficient and impactful. And with that said, thanks for watching. And until next time, may your transactions be as valuable as a Bitcoin block.